Today, the nation, folks across Alabama, and right here along the Gulf Coast are remembering our veterans. There have been several events across the area today honoring our veterans for their service, but one of the most heartfelt stories comes from a little girl from outside our viewing area. A nine-year-old Gracie, who lives in Dothan, wrote a letter to her late great-grandfather who served in World War II. Local 15's Darwin Singleton was tipped on this by her proud sister who lives here in Mobile. Darwin, this is a bit more than just a history lesson. Well, it is, Greg. It's a lesson that's never too late to tell someone how proud you are of them and how much you love them. Local 15 viewer Tiffany Ford lives here in Mobile, but her baby sister, nine-year-old Gracie Sasser, lives in Dothan. Now, Gracie did something for Veterans Day that Tiffany wanted to share with us. The two sisters lost their great-grandfather, Lieutenant Colonel Ira C. Weatherly, Jr., last summer. That's little Gracie there. Gracie loved him a lot, and on this Veterans Day, she wanted to let him and everyone know how proud she is of his service to her country, so she wrote this letter to her late grandfather. Turns out, Colonel Weatherly piloted the weather reconnaissance plane during that mission that dropped the atomic bomb in Hiroshima, Japan, ushering an end to the war in the Pacific. Not only were you a brave soldier and a great pilot, she wrote, you were an amazing fisherman and a funny great grandpa. Believe it or not, fourth grade is learning about World War II and they are probably going to learn about you, she wrote. She also tells her great grandfather that his wife is doing well and Gracie wishes she could thank her hero face to face. So, I asked her by telephone if her great grandfather was alive today, what would she tell him? And she sent me back this video answer. Thanks for serving our country and being a brave army man and a great fisherman. Love you. Young Gracie's letter is a great way to remember our veterans and maybe something you'd like to do with your child. You might be surprised at what they say and how they feel. So, Tiffany, thanks for sharing this with us and our viewers. It's not groundbreaking, earth-shattering news, but it's news that matters. It's yeah. beautiful. All right, Darwin, thanks.